Today we're going to make this roll. So we're going to, we have gr grease paper, gr ground cinnamon, a, a brush which is used for, for butter on the tray to spread it. Then we have the puff pastry for the Swiss roll. Then we have some soap nuts, which are raisins. Then we have some dark brown soft sugar. Then we have some butter. And, and we have a knife, which we're cutting the puff pastry. Then we have a chopping board. And we have a baking tray. So we took out the puff pastry out the back. And and my dad has rolled it out. We have the melted water which we melted and made it go and we're going to spread it down. Now we're just spreading the, the melted water around the puff, the puff pastry. I'm going to get the ground cinnamon and I'm going to sprinkle it on top of the puff pastry which has the, the butter spread. To brush the cinnamon around the puff pastry. All around. Slowly. Now my dad just put the brown sugar and now I'm just spreading it now. Just all around the puff pastry with brown cinnamon. Kids all love this treat because it's sweet and nice. Get the, the sugar all, all evenly. Now I'm going to spread it. Bring the raisins evenly now. Now we're nearly done. The only thing is we have to roll it. Now my dad's going to roll the door.
Now it's ready after it's put it on the tray. And the last thing is to do is put it in the oven. To Before you put it in the oven, preheat to the 170 degrees for 10 minutes. Bake them for 15 or 20 minutes. I'm mixing up the icing sugar now for the Swiss roll. Make sure it's not too watery. Make sure it's not too watery. Now my dad is piping the sugar, the icing sugar on the Swiss rolls. It smells really good. After you pipe the sugar, you can put anything on top you want. Now you're just going to put on some sugar on top.